Hi guys, Todd here. Today I got a delivery from Daz at safersigs.co.uk which was great. Uh, I spoke to Daz yesterday and I've not heard from him for a while uh, but he's back on the mend and uh, good to hear from him again. Daz sent me on a range of drip tips. These drip tips are made in the UK and they are sold through safersigs.co.uk the range in price and uh, I'll tell you the prices uh, but all of them are available on Daz's website. Right, we'll, we'll start this side and we'll work our way to this side. Uh, this is the, the Brass Droid, uh, this one. As you can guess is Brass. Next to our Delrin we have the Delrin Empire Extra Large, the Delrin Natty here this is the Empire Drip Tip, the Empire Extra Large, the Mastiff, Mastiff, the Natty, the Delrin Bolt, the Delrin Droid, and finally we've got a Whistle Tip one at the very end here. So we'll just have a quick look at these. Uh, dripper, there's the board going right through. Quite a nice short drip tip. And these ones here are all roughly about the same size. I mean, total length, and you're looking about 21, 22 mil for you know all these ones here. And for the the longer ones, you're looking about yeah 30.5. That's top to bottom. That's the entire length there. The bore looks much the same on all of them, to be perfectly honest. The Delrin ones are. I don't really use Delrin ones a lot, I must admit, but it's got to be said they're a little damn sight easier to keep clear like the cuts on this uh, Empire here. Yeah, I've got the slots in it there. This is the, the stainless steel Empire. I do like the droids. The droids are quite nice. I like the brass one. I do really like this brass one. Now there's only so much I can do with uh, drip tips. I can't really tell you much about them other than what you see. Uh, now one thing I have found just trying these drip tips in various things that are lying about the shed, uh, I found that they fit in nearly, you know they're just generic, you know they fit in my mods and atties no problem at all. Um, I've tried them in various things. The only problem I seem to have found is when it comes to things like, well, when I say things like the Kangar Aero Tank and the Kangar Pro Tank 3, I tried them in there. Now the Delrin, Delrin tips would fit in no problem, but the metal tips didn't want to fit at all. Uh, they just wouldn't fit and I have to tell you that. Uh, but it was just on the Kangar Pro Tanks that I was having problems in the Kangar Aero Tank. Uh, everything else has been fine. Right, here's one here. I'm just this is an Ingus Ignis by Futon, and you see it fits in there no problem at all. Brass droid. It's lovely. Mm. Uh, Delrin tips. No problem there. I really like this. See this, you know, it's got a narrow middle section and a wide tube at the top, a wide lip at the top. It's really nice for vaping on. Mm. <laughs> That's why I just really enjoy vaping with these. Um, so that, I mean, that's it. Uh, the, the, there's not really much else I can tell you. I'm, I'm actually quite enjoying the the the, Del the black Delrin ones. Yeah, like I say, I've never really used them. Uh, in the past, but uh, I got some off Jim in the past. I mean, th they are quite nice. Mm, nice to see. Anyway, that's it from me. Uh, I'd like to thank Daz at Safer Six for sending these on, and uh, good to see you back out and about, mate. And um, 
you know, if you're interested in any of these, please go along to safersigs.co.uk and you'll find them under the drip tips section. That's it. We'll catch up with you soon. Cheers guys. Bye now.